Okay, you happy Chinese shoe patcher machine aficionados. Safe cracker here. Been a long time since I've made a video, but this one is worth making. For over two weeks, I fought thread breaking, getting cut, bunching up in the needle, packing up on, on top of the uh, bobbin. You name it, I was fighting it. And I, I searched YouTube and I searched and I searched and I could not find anybody that answered my question. Finally, I did figure out what I was doing wrong. There is a right way and a wrong way to put that needle in the shoe patcher. These bigger needles, they don't have the flat side on them like res like home sewing machines do, where they have the flat and you can't put it in backwards. These round headed needles are easy to put in backwards. There is a groove down one side of the needle. I'm going to do my best to show it to you. You see that groove there going into that needle? It's not real big. It's kind of hard to see, but it is there. Point that groove to the left side of your machine where the thread comes in from the left side of your machine point that groove that way that solved every one of my problems I am now back to a happy sewer and I just I fought it so long and hard and I am certain that other people have fought it so I hope this helps you. I really do. I, I'm glad I found it when I did. For one thing, it is burnt into my memory now. I will never forget it. Point that groove to the, groove to the left, and that should solve all of your sewing problems. This is Safe Cracker. Y'all have a real good day, and happy sewing.